Hello, my name is Phyllis Trailer, and I am the owner of Texas Notary Public Professional Training Academy, and I just wanted to share some bit information about the Training Academy. So you can get to Texas Notary Public Professional Training Academy by going to TexasNotaryTrainingAcademy.com. Now here we have uh, you'll find information about several courses that I teach. And one of the things about the courses that I think is a good thing is the courses are offered in uh, several different formats. You can take the course online. I have pre-recorded uh, classes. You can also uh, do the webinar training. And uh, I also have live classroom trainings. And if you want uh, to download information about the courses and the training, you can just click any of the links here and find out if additional information. We also have a mentorship program. So if you go to the, um, the course website, the homepage, this is what you're going to see. And you can find out more information about the um, about myself a conference that we have coming up for oh no this was the texas secretary of state's conference but we do have a conference coming up for uh notary public day which is uh notary public day is november 7th and our conference is going to be november 9th uh, if you click on training Here, you will see the different training that we offer. You also see some interviews that I uh, did. I did one with uh, Bill Soroka and one with uh, my very good friend, Carol Ray. You also see some introductions to the courses. Here, you'll see uh, the online courses. These are pre recorded online courses that I offer. And there's a link here for registration to go to those online courses. So currently I offer the Texas Notary Public Training Workshop, which is just a basic course for Texas Notary Public. Now one thing to keep in mind is in Texas, there's no required training to become a notary public. However, you still need to know what you're doing because you're fully responsible for everything that you notarize. So with that being said, you know, if you do something wrong, even though there's no required training, you can still get in trouble. So you want to make sure you know what you're doing. Now offer a workshop and an advanced course. The advanced course goes into more um, advanced um, situations that you might come across. And there are two different prices. However, you can purchase the courses as a bundle and save about $20. Now, what's covered in the courses. So in the Texas Notary Public Training Workshop, we discuss how to become a Texas Notary Public because that's one of the first questions I get when people call about the class is, um, will you show us what we need to do to become a Notary Public? And while, you know, many people are already notaries a lot of people don't even know where to start to become a notary. So I'll go over the basics, basics and show them how to get started. We also discuss reasons for rejection, suspension, and revocation because that's very important. You need to know what can cause you to lose your notary commission and what can cause you know you to, your application to be rejected. Um, Another very important topic is duties of a Texas notary public. So as a notary, you need to know what you can and can't do. Uh, your authorized notarial fees. The state sets the fees that we can uh, charge as notaries. And this is very important also. 
because this is one of the reasons why uh, you could get suspended or your commission could be uh, taken away is if, if you are charging too much for your notarial services. Uh, your record keeping requirements in Texas, we are required to keep a journal. So a lot of people don't know that. And also, not only are we required to keep a journal, we are not, should not ever have anybody um, put a thumbprint in the journal. Even though there's a place for that in the journals, we don't use thumbprints in uh, Texas. We also don't list any uh, any numbers like social security numbers, driver's license numbers, or anything of that nature. So it's uh, this is a very important because every notary that we complete needs to be annotated in our notary journal. So you need to learn how to use that. Also, you need to know what your responsibilities are as a notary. Uh, we also cover how to complete a notarial certificate. And I cannot even emphasize how important this is because there are notaries who have been notaries for several years who don't know what a notarial certificate is. I have come across a numerous documents that have a notary stamp, but no notarial certificate. So that tells me that there is a need for this training. Um, we need to know the difference between an affidavit and a jurat. And this is covered extensively in the training. Uh, how to handle certified copies. There's certain documents that cannot, uh, we as notaries cannot certify copies of. So you need to know that. You need to be aware of that. How to administer an oath. Uh, just what you can and cannot do. Uh, also, the unauthorized practice of law. There's a fine line that you don't want to cross as a notary public. And there's other things that we'll cover in the workshop. Uh, the Texas Notary Public Advanced Training Course will talk about notarizing for signers with disabilities because you will come across um, signers who have a disability when it comes to signing. So you want to know how to handle those situations. Also, again, we're going to talk about go into more detail about the notarial certificates and uh, also how to handle handwritten documents, uh, your the proper record keeping procedures. And again, this is just going more in depth about your notarial journal. Uh, notarizing documents requiring witnesses, avoiding official misconduct, Notarizing documents in foreign languages. Uh, I just came across a case like this, so it's just really important that we discuss this. Notarizing translations, and translations meaning documents translated in a foreign language. Signing with a power of attorney. So how does a signer sign the document if they're signing with a power of attorney? Uh, incompetent signers, you know, one of our duties is to make sure that the signer understands what they're signing. So we'll go over that. Uh, using credible witnesses. In Texas, we can use a credible witness. So we'll discuss that. Advertising. If you're doing this for a business, you want to know the advertising do's or don'ts and much more. So, um, we're also, I am an authorized trainer, the only authorized uh, trainer to teach notary to pro in a live classroom environment. So, um, I'm really honored that uh, Carol Ray has allowed me to do this. And um, this is something um, that I take very seriously. Because I know that 
Notary to Pro, the training is Carol's baby. This is something that she created. And a lot of people have asked me, Phyllis, why do you teach Carol Ray's course instead of teaching your own course? And the reason why is I'm like, her course is so thorough. It covers everything. It's like, you know, why invent, reinvent the wheel when there's something already there? that's going to suffice. I mean, this is the course that I took when I first started doing notary loan signings. And I really think this is what helped take my business to the next level. So this is something that I would like to share with other people, other notaries who are, you know, serious about this business. So I do teach her class. I'm the only one that teaches, teaches it in a live classroom environment. So I, right now I'm teaching it in San Antonio. And I cover the same topics that Carol covers in her online course. The only difference is I do it live. Uh, the live course is a six hour course. We do it all in one day. And it's, um, I mean, you really learn what you need to do to get your business started as a loan signing agent and also how to actually handle loan signings. So some of the topics we cover in that Notary to Pro course include the uh, marketing your business, uh, your accounting concepts. We talk a little bit about e-signing, title and escrow. The, and then of course we go over the closing documents that was included in this course is also the certification test. So you do uh, have the opportunity to become notary to pro certified. And of course, this is a big deal. So all of the students that take this course become notary to pro certified. You have all the same um benefits, you get all the same perks as somebody who had taken Carol Ray's online course, which is, you know, a really great, great benefit. So I'm going to go to Carol's website. So once you become a Notary to Pro graduate, then you will have access to all of her graduate information and I wanted to go to her graduate website. Hold on a second. But I don't see it. I guess I should have had it already set up, but I didn't. But anyway, she has a graduate website that has all this good information and free stuff for her graduates, which I just love. I think that's worth the, the fee for the course in itself. Uh, also, Carol offers this course, this Notary to Pro training course in Spanish. So if you know of any Spanish speaking notaries who are interested in becoming loan signing agents, because there is a need, especially here in Texas, for uh, Spanish speaking uh, loan signers. Please encourage them to take uh, Carol's uh, Notary to Pro course in Spanish. And if you have any questions about anything, please feel free to contact me. And uh, I'll be more than happy to go over this with you. And contact information, the phone number email address. So again, if you have any questions, feel, please feel free to contact me. Thank you. Have a great day. Bye-bye.